Right, I'm wandering down this lovely country lane. There's a lovely couple of little cottages back there. The stream running nearby and decorated with beautiful flowers. I've taken photos. Um, I don't really know where I am. I don't really care either. Uh, it's possible this is the track I come up um, later. One way or another, it's taken me that way. It's only just gone quarter past. Oh, lots of cars. Lots and lots of cars. What I'm saying is, lots and lots of cars. Now, one way or another, right in front of me, is East Quandot Egg. Now, here is a style. This is going to test me now. I mean, I'm quite happy to go carry on around the lane. This will test me to see if I want to go through this field of cows, which I know are there. See? This will test me. Because there, I've got to go over there, but there's the cows. I've only got to get over there. We could risk it, they look dopey. They must be used to people coming in. There's the, the mansion over there. And there's the cows. <sighs> I've seen people walk across here the other day, Sheila. I think you should try it. They're, they look very docile. They look very docile. They'll get to a point where you'll be halfway across and it'll be as bad going back as forward. Now, because it's going downhill, I would say carry on walking, you won't break run off, and you're going to get to a point where you can't turn back, because you'll be going uphill. The distance between going back and going uphill Well, she'll just keep going, girl. You won't outrun them even now. Just keep going. You can't. You can try and be brave. There's another field that you could try. This one hasn't got the bull in it, apparently. I'm videoing this. Everyone. Do you realise how brave I'm being? I'm in a cow field. The fact that I've seen a group of people the other day of 12 people, 13 people walking through it, gave me hope that they might be alright this lot. Oh my god. Phone's ringing again. Can't answer it, could frighten the cows. They are looking round. Won't like that, will they? Well, I'm just going to look over at them now. That could spook them, you see. There they are. They look up. They look like proper cows, proper farm cows that aren't um, aggressive. That are looked after well here. They've even got a calf suckling.
Oh, I feel very brave. Now, of course, we know there's a field there with a bull in it. They warn you about that, so... And there isn't a public path across there. So we've done very well, Sheila. Earlier, they were right in the middle of the path. And, um... This is a bit like being on a safari in England, isn't it, really? You're out looking at the wild animals. There's a little calf, let's see. He's suckling. He's looking over as well. Now they look happy cows. They're happy. They're cared for properly, I think. I think when cows are aggressive, there's, there's a reason for it. When they get like that. Right, God, I do feel relieved. Although I could have just walked around the edge here. I could have done that. You know? This is where we make another decision. Now I've just walked, I've just been skirting all of the contacts down around the bottom there and I nearly came down another way which would have, I would have ended up coming down the track I went up this morning I think if I'd done that one but uh, that's, it's nice to know there is a path here that can get you up on the contacts. For example, um, I want to do that Smith Coombe one day, you could actually do it from here. But of course, like I say, you can never guarantee Oh, they there They could be cows, you know what? I reckon there might have been cows in the field I just walked through But they were further down God, that was lucky, wasn't it? I've just seen them They were further down in the valley Oh, quite unbelievable this, isn't it? This is real farmland here. Look at that, barrels of hay on the hayrick. Now I'm back to more or less where I started nearly now. I would love to feel brave and go across that other field. Obviously not that one. They're telling you, they're warning you. There's a bull in there. I don't know, they look young and frisky. No, I'm not, I'm not going to do it. I don't feel quite as brave the second time. I think once is enough for now. They look young black balls. I, no, I don't fancy that. Right, we're walking back down through the village now. So although I wanted to do that, I'm happy with what I've achieved. Because believe it or not, there were cows in that field we come across. So this is East Quantock Head, everyone. Some lovely farmyard architecture about. And this is how they do it. I remember the whole the old hayricks when I was a kid, you know, on Chilcock's farm. Yeah, I remember all that. There's Luttrell's mansion over there. Seven centuries, summer buried in the graveyard. I spotted them this morning. Younger versions, of course, like you know, last hundred or so years. The main family will be inside under the church, I should imagine. Yeah, no, I don't mind walking down here. I don't mind. If some of the lips look like Four young black cows. Yeah. I seen those people earlier. <gasps> I'm going to over and out for a minute. 